You know what sucks is that, you know, we live in America and things are still censored. And I believe they're still censored because there's certain videos, if I don't touch certain things and they're just like lightweight and fluffy, they seem to get a lot more traction than the ones that don't. And, you know, and then I don't want to be judged by my peers, my family, my friends, you know, by posting. It's like, it's kind of embarrassing that I even do this. You know, I feel like there's not a lot of people I tell because I don't want to be judged. Like, oh, you're on YouTube. Like, that's so stupid, you know. Um, you're trying to be famous and it's like, no, I'm just really trying to build community. I'm really looking to make connections. There's, you know, a handful of people that I follow and, you know, a lot of them speak from their heart and I find them to be extremely courageous. It is very hard to record yourself unless you're, I mean, just a narcissist and this is something that you truly enjoy, but to actually record yourself, listen to yourself, talk, find something you need to talk about that's important and substantial and, um, and really put yourself out there. It's very, very courageous. And it's, you know, it's not about being right or wrong. It's the fact that you have enough courage and belief about what you're saying to, to move it forward. And, you know, I can't say enough about RFK, you know, whether you like him, hate him, disagree with him, agree with him. I mean, that guy has put his heart out there as far as his belief and what he wants for this country. And it is inspiring because if you don't agree with him or you do agree with him, the fact that he has the courage to say it and then just take the assaults that he takes um, and the constant mudslinging, I mean, gosh, on a good day, I wish I had that kind of character. You know, I worry constantly about what people think. I don't tell people in my life a lot, you know, that I even try to record a YouTube and it's like, I'm looking for community. I'm looking for sharing. I'm looking for people that will share their experiences and what's going on with them in different states, different countries. Um, and for me to share what my little piece of the pie looks like from here, I am a lower middle class American citizen. I am generation after generation of that thinking that, you know, and I've said it before, like doing the right thing, grinding away, you know, that's what this country was built on. And it is, it is, if we grind together, we don't attack one another, we support one another, and we don't bury our heads in the sand. And we look to continue to educate ourselves, to challenge ourselves, to contribute to the, the communities and the cultures that we are part of. Um, this whole, like, don't talk to me. You hurt my feelings because you said one thing. I mean, how are we ever going to get where we get to know one another? Because things are going to be said, you know, there are certain words my kids are like, oh, you can't say that now, you know, and they'll explain to me why I can't say that now. And I don't mean it under the context that it is said or is perceived today. Does that make me ignorant? No, I don't think it does. I listen to my kids. I absorb what they say. I see where they're coming from and I understand their generation is differently and they interpret that word differently. So what do you do? You adjust your cells. You know, I don't want to offend anybody. It's not fun. Um, I don't take no pleasure in that. Um, I think that us being united and making eye contact at the grocery store, uh, giving a compliment to somebody, uh, not picking somebody apart, not being behind a comment on a screen when you're too scared to post something yourself and belittling somebody else for actually trying and putting themselves out there. You know, the person putting themselves out there, whether you agree with them or not, it takes courage, you know? And uh, it's a very, very sad day today that somebody that would be probably extremely um, amazing for this country uh, might not make that. Uh, a possibility and uh, I just it's disheartening